Good morning, Mr. Stubbs. Good morning. My name is Dr. Sunil Wigg. I'm one of the psychiatrists working in the Drug and Alcohol Service. Okay. Um, I understand that you wanted to talk about um, some of the difficulties that you, you've been experiencing lately. Well, it wasn't really my idea. Mm -hmm. um, Brenda, my, my missus, she, she wanted me to come in. Okay. <clears throat> mm. um, well, tell me a bit about what, you, what Brenda's concerned about. She thinks I'm drinking too much. Okay. Mm. All right. I don't, I don't think so, but she said um, if I didn't come in that we'd have to reconsider the relationship. Okay. I appreciate you've taken a big step in coming here to see me today. Um, I'm sure your relationship means um, a lot to you and you definitely want to, to sort things out with your partner. I do. Yeah. Can you, can you tell me a bit more about um, what Brenda's concerned and how you see the, the situation? Well, she says I'm drinking too much. Mm -hmm. um, I, don't, I don't think I am. Mm -hmm. um, I have a couple of drinks with friends yep. after work. Okay. Yeah. Um, what do you work as? I'm a builder. Okay. And how long have you been uh, employed as a builder for? About 10 years. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are you self-employed or are you... I am. Oh, okay. So you run your own business. Mm -hmm. How's that going? Fine. Okay. Fine. I okay. enjoy it. Okay. Um, so, just uh, uh, focusing on your on your drinking. Is it all right if I call you by your first name, Greg? That's fine. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, Greg, um, just focusing on drinking. Can you tell me a bit about when you first started drinking? When I was about sixteen. Okay. Yep. And what what did you start drinking? I was drinking beer. Okay. And uh, how has how has that progressed over time? Ah, oh, well, I drink whiskey now. Okay. Um, Yes, I'm, it, I'm off the beer. Okay, is that your, your drink of choice now? Yeah, Jack Daniels and Coke. Okay, so if we focused over the last uh, month, mm -hmm. um, what's your what would be your average intake over the over a week? Oh, so a couple after work with friends, um, five sometimes more, maybe yeah. seven or eight of of Jack Daniels okay. of whiskey. Okay, and mm -hmm. do you whiskey with Coke? With Coke, okay. Mm -hmm. So about five, do you drink on a regular basis every day? Yeah. After work? Yeah. yeah. Would that ever be a, a little bit more, say seven, eight, nine, ten? Depends on the night, what's happening with the boys, yep. but can can get that much. Okay. So what would be the maximum you could, you would drink in a day? Oh, probably ten, but... Okay. Mm. All right. Um, do you ever crave um, for a drink? Yeah, uh, after work, I'm usually looking forward to yeah. one or some. Okay, and when you do start drinking, can you stop at one drink if you have to? Yeah, it's hard to, you know, when you're out with friends. Yeah. Yeah, Instantly, probably, probably not, but mm -hmm. it doesn't really come up. Okay, and have you found that, you, you did mention that um, when you were 16 you started drinking, and um, you, over the years, uh, I mean, you've, you've moved from beer to... To whiskey now, but have you found that over the years your your alcohol intake has increased? Sure, sure, mm -hmm. yeah, a little bit. Okay, and and um, do you feel that you need say more drinks to get the same effect as you used to in the past? Same buzz. Yeah, yeah, but it's getting a bit older. Mm. Mm. Okay, and what about when you um, when was your last period um, of abstinence when you did not drink at all? Before I started drinking. Okay. So you've been a fairly regular drinker over the last yeah. uh, several years. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, have you ever experienced withdrawals when you've stopped drinking? Where you've experienced severe shakes, you're sweaty, you're trembly, your heart's beating really fast? Yeah. There's been occasions. Yeah. A couple. Okay. A couple of occasions. Okay. Um, so... Brenda's obviously concerned about your drinking. Um, has the drinking ever gotten you, gotten you into trouble um, with with the police? I've been I have been arrested once for drink driving. Okay. Um, uh, th there's been a, a few fights at the pub. Yeah. Nothing nothing too big with involving the police or anything. I, okay. I did break my hand once. Okay. Yeah. Have you ever seriously injured your head in a fight like this or? I I did have a fractured cheekbone mm -hmm. this is when I broke my hand. Yeah. Um but I I came out of that alright. 
Okay. Yeah. Um, what about a uh, serious head injury where you lost consciousness? Yeah, nothing like that. No. no. Okay. Do you have you ever had blackouts where you you don't remember what you've done the previous day? No. 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 So you did talk about you did mention the drink driving. You got in trouble with the police because of that. Okay. Yeah. What well, at home the relationship with Brenda? How's that been affected? Well, when I have been drinking, we argue a lot. Mm -hmm. um, she says I get aggressive. Yeah. Um, and when I'm not drinking, yeah. she we argue about the drinking. Sure. Mm. Does that ever get physical? No. No. Have you ever seen? You know, hit her as a result. I've never, never done that. Oh. I, I've, we've got into a couple of <laughs> yelling contests. Yeah. Yeah. But it's never progressed to. No. Okay. All right. So just um. Um, summarizing, you've, you've, you've started drinking when you were 16, you moved from beer to, to whiskey now, and uh, now you're drinking on a, on a fairly regular basis. You do crave for it after, after work, um, and uh, you, you sort of require a bit more to get the same buzz as well. Yeah. 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 Have you ever tried stopping yourself in the past? No. 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 Okay. All right. Um, over the last, um, say, month or so, uh, how would you describe your mood? Mood's fine. Yeah? Yeah. Um, have you felt unusually low or depressed in yourself? No. No. Are you able to enjoy time with your friends and work? As yeah, well? yeah. Yeah? Okay. Your energy level's keeping up with work? Fine. And your yeah. sleep? What's that been like? S sleep's all right. I, if I, I do need, <coughs> I need a drink do, before I go to sleep just okay. because of work. Yeah, sure. But um, other than that, mm -hmm. it's all right. Okay. Mm. And um, have you ever had any strange experiences at all? Um, like hearing voices when you're on your own? No. Uh, no. Feeling paranoid? No. Um, like people trying to harm you or conspire against you in any way? No. No. What about anxiety or feelings of nervousness? Um, worrying about simple things that you shouldn't be worrying about? Mm, not in general, no. No? no. Panic attacks? No. 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 Okay, we, we talked about the alcohol. Do you use any other drugs besides alcohol? No. Like cannabis? No. Cocaine? Amphetamine? No. 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 Um, have you used them in the past? Oh, back, back in school I, I did have, did drop the, the, odd, the odd pill. Yep. But phew, once or twice it's, I'm, I've never really been into that stuff. Okay. Yeah. Have you ever had it on a regular basis? No, definitely no. not. No. Okay. All right. Um, just uh, moving on from there, uh, you, you, you said that you have your own business yes. um, and you work as a builder, is that correct? That's right. Have you ever been to work um, under the influence of alcohol? No, no, I'm, I'm not about that. Okay, do you ever drink first thing in the morning? No, definitely okay. not. Okay. Any financial difficulties that you're experiencing because of the alcohol? No, I, I, I'm, I can afford it. Okay. Mm. All right. Um, how do you see your, your alcohol use at this point in time? I've I feel it's fairly moderate. Mm -hmm. mm.